Here we are at the McClure Dam on the Dead River. It was built about 1920 by the Cleveland Cliffs Iron Company. There's the spillway portion. That's the riverbed below. That's just a certain amount of water that they let through the riverbed to keep the river flowing. And this is the second dam down from the hoist dam, or it's the third one up from the mouth of the river. And the penstock comes out in that direction, goes down to the powerhouse. It's about a 13,000 foot long penstock that uh, you can't see it because it's all buried. Most of it was wood until just a few years ago when they replaced the whole thing with a steel one. And that goes down about two and a half miles and drops 424 feet vertically in that distance. So that gives you 424 feet of water column vertical water column between the dam and the powerhouse. That gives you a lot of pressure to generate a lot of power.